by gang, only me, Sean, from Happy Days Veg. You find me, let me bend down. Sorry about the wind and the angle, I just want to show you what I'm doing. Uh, you find me planting out my main crop potatoes. I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I've got 10 more containers to do. But before I run out of potato fertilizer, that's all I've got left. I want to show you how I plant my potatoes. You'll know, you'll know from previous videos, I've got these containers, big containers that I've got down, put the handles in, drainage holes. I'll put two big shovels of well-rotted horse manure in the bottom. I'll put a sprinkling of uh, fish blood and bone in there, I think, yeah. And I've uh, sprinkled in a handful of uh, potato fertilizer. And on top of the uh, well-rotted horse manure, I've, put, I've just tipped in a big container, five litres of, uh, seven and a half litres rather, of uh, compost. And then, these are the potatoes I've bought uh, that are not chitted. These are Heidi Red main crop potatoes. There's no sign of, let me put my glasses on. Let me put my glasses on. Yeah, I bought these last week and there's not a sign of any chits. But notwithstanding, I'm still putting three deep in there, row side down, yeah. And this, this will decide whether once and for all it's necessary to chit your to chit your potatoes. Can you hear me? This will prove whether it's necessary to chit your potatoes. So I'm covering them over. I am going to put more compost on there now. I've just got to get another bag. But I just wanted you to see how I do it. I'll fill it up to there with compost. And then, uh, hopefully, it, they'll get rained on tonight. Uh, but I'll water them tomorrow. And then uh, I'll top them up. And then, uh, once they come through, I'll top them up again. And then top them off with grass. So that's how I do it. And uh, once I've finished, I'll show you a video of everything I've got. So until then, happy days. Afternoon, folks. I'm not going to tell you who it is because you should know by now. Go on, then. It's me, Sean, from Happy Days Veg. Have you noticed I've had a lovely haircut as well? I'm back to my gorgeous self. So, I was going slightly off kilter there. I've got you in the standing in the polytunnel to keep you, the microphone sheltered from the wind. But as you can see over there, I've finally planted all my potatoes for the 20, 2021 season. And it's worked out perfect. I've got uh, 90 containers. I've got 20 containers on the first row of first earlies 21 containers of second earlies because i don't believe there's such a type of second earlies i just think it that it's it's the same as the first earlies or whatever i think it's just something to make you part with your money and then i've got three rows of what are more or less main crop potatoes now in there there is a couple four or five containers of second early is that I didn't realize I had chitting I got mixed up I didn't read the label properly that's why you should always put your glasses on uh, but yeah and and I've got some out there that have saved uh, Rabinta saved seed potatoes from last uh, season so I'm well happy it's the 28th or the 29th uh, third, uh, 30 days of September, just the Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, 24, 24, 24. It's the 28th. See how good I am with my maths and my fingers. Uh, I should go on countdown, really. Uh, so, yeah, it's the 28th and it's 20 to 7. I think it's about 20 to 7 on the evening. I went out food, I had to go food shopping this morning uh, and I've been on this all day. Oh, I had a Catastro catastrophe planting some, uh, sowing some uh, 
pricking out and potting on some tomatoes. But that's a story for another day. I can't go into that. I'll, you'll have me crying. So at least all my potatoes are planted. So yeah, admittedly, I'm going to wait for them to come through before I top them up. I don't know. Depending on, you know, if I've got a spare half hour, I'll do it. Uh, I've got to spice them out and I've got to put the watering, self-watering pipes across the top. But the main thing is they're planted. Uh, so they're telling us that my, uh, over to bank holiday next week, I've been told. The butcher told me to bank holiday next weekend. Bank holiday, I'll get paid double time. Uh, the say my is going to be the dry my on record. So this leads me back to another video. Make sure you've got plenty of rainwater harvested uh, and containers of water harvested, if possible, uh, on your allotments, in your gardens, close to where you need them. Because if May is, is as hot and as dry as they forecast it's going to be, we could be in for a load of trouble. Now, luckily for me, most of my containers are full. Uh, but we've hardly had any rain. It rained yesterday for a bit. Hardly rained. Didn't make any difference. It was dry again after five minutes. So, yeah, just make sure you've got plenty of rainwater harvested and your water butts are filled up. Uh, and, you know, you, you, you want the water where you need it, you know. So, uh, so yeah, I'm going to love you and leave you because I'm celebrating now. I've finished planting my potatoes. So I'm going to go in and celebrate with a nice glass of Samyon Blanc. Uh, so until then, I hope you're all well, stay safe, uh, and uh, let me know if you think I'm a bit late in planting my main crop potatoes. I can't remember when I planted my, my main crop potatoes last season, or last year, uh, but I'm not, I'm, as I say, I'm not in no rush, uh, and also, I picked up a tip on spraying your potato foliage when it comes through uh, later on in the season, after, in, in, in a, about mid-July, I think he starts, uh, from another great YouTuber uh, who knows, who knows his onions. I've took a lot of tips and advice off him. I can't remember his name and I don't want to tell you because I don't want to get it wrong. So I'm going to look it up and I'm going to send it out because he's... he's He's the bee's knees. Uh, so, uh, so yeah, this video's dragging on. And i got to go because I'm knackered and my feet are throbbing. So until then, take care. It's Sean signing off from Happy Days Veg.